So my mom went and got me some mice for the snakes and they already ate. And she also got me this little guy. This is called a horn worm. You can see the horn, that's his hind end. And his face is right here. And um, I have have videotaped me feeding Sullivan a horn worm before. But um, I had I fed lots of the animals. Oh, do you see it, Sullivan? Aww. You see the yummy horn worm? And so, oh, he's really sticking to me. Whoa, sticky horn worm. They've got good little grippers. Wow. Let go. Now he's going to stick to that. Let go. It's time for you to get eaten. Ugh. Sullivan. Sully. So I'm put him down on the ground. No, Sullivan, you're going the wrong way. That's an empty dish of cockroaches. And your foot's in the water. Oh, I'm sorry it's in the shadow. Oh yeah. So apparently hornworms are, um, have a lot of, um, water in them. And so they're a good source of hydration for the leopard geckos. And apparently the horn does not, you can see the horn right now, but I guess it doesn't bother them so much for self good mechanism to, what's the word? I don't know. I know what I'm talking. It's kind of like, oh, is that good, Sullivan? That was pretty yummy. You look happy. All right. There we go. There is Sullivan and his nice, fat, happy tail. His, um, of course, the, the, um, they are like yeah, of course, the hornworm is in his belly right now, but his tail is like a camel and where it stores all the fat and stuff like that. So the fatter the tail, the more, um, uh, you know, fat the gecko has to spare. And so they can live off of that. So if you see a skinny-tailed gecko, that's not a good thing. That means that it's um, not healthy. So Sullivan has a nice fat tail. And uh, he eats mainly cockroaches, but every once in a while, I like to feed him a hornworm. And that was the second time eating a hornworm. His first time eating a hornworm was on the other video. And if you want to watch that video, you can. But um, it's kind of a long video because I feed every single one of my animals in that video. And so I think it ended up being like a 45-minute video or something like that. So, But um, yeah, so that was just a woman eating a hornworm. Gonna go on top of your rock? What are you gonna do now? You don't wanna go hide. All right, I'm gonna post this tomorrow so it'll be a day late. But, um, good night everybody. Well, maybe I'll post it tonight. I have to see. I'm feeling really nauseous right now. My mom is down feeding the animals, the goats and the donkeys. Oh, there she is. Yeah, Mom? Oh, did they? Maybe they... All right. Okay, they probably did then. Um... Yeah, they and then the thank you Brennans who are gonna watch this video and um, not the Brennans. The Brennans maybe helped feed, but it was probably uh, Betty and Frank. Thank you, Betty and Frank. 
they fed the animals, not my mom. They're awesome. I love my neighbors, and I love my mom, and I love my dad. I love everybody that helps me, obviously, but I really, I couldn't have all these animals if I didn't have all the help that I have, and um, everybody is just super awesome, so I want to take this time to just say thanks to all the help that I get. Um, without help, I would not be able to have these animals, and the animals are my passion, and they keep me going, so... Um, for that, I just want to say thank you. All right. Good night, everybody.